Mick, we're here nestled in the heart of Norfolk on behalf of XYZ. You've got three of their machines here, in fact. We're going to look at two today. And this is the simplest in terms of turning that you've got. It's the SLX 1630. How long have you had this machine? Well, we've had this machine now for approximately four years. In that time, it has earned its money times and times over. In, in, in what way, Mick? I mean, your machine in plastics here, is it because of how easy it is to set or program? Well, it's very easy to do both. The programming system is Prototrack, and it was my first ever venture onto a CNC. And did you need a lot of training to be able to get making components? We managed to make a few simple ones to start with. And as parts that we took on got more complex, that is where XYZ came into their own. The backup is superb. And I like to think we've made a personal friend of at least one of their, their men. And that's important, especially if this was your first CNC, where you're located. If you needed help, they were here, were they? Oh, yes. We are in the middle of nowhere on the edge of Sandringham Estate, but... That's why we had cucumber sandwiches for lunch. That's exactly right, and you'll notice they were triangular. <laughs> <laughs> but the machine, or you've spoken about the programming side, what about the machine itself when you've gone from maybe a manual machine to being able to do both here? Because you can use this machine manually as well as with the CNC controlled. Does it give you a lot more flexibility? It gives a lot of flexibility, yes. I mean, this machine is just a two-axis. And uh, the big thing about it, we've got the automatic tool post on it. You set your program, set it to run, and clear off and come back and get the parts out. Correctly made, which is the most important thing. Oh, yes. So this is the simplest one. We're going to go to a bit of a contrast here. Let's go and have a look at the, uh, the CT machine. <laughs> OK. So Mick, there's a, there's a bit more to this machine in terms of sophistication. Well, you've gone from a very, well, your start of CNC there into something really sophisticated here. Well, that's right. This was a continuation of the story. Parts got more complex. Parts do for every industry. And it was getting to the point where the little old lathe couldn't do the more complex parts. And there were a lot of operations on manual machines to finish them off. So we bought this one off XYZ. And this is the, this is the CT52 LTY, so you've got a long bed, you've got milling, and you've got, as well, a Y-axis. Yes, we have. It's proven itself, and again, it's made its money times over. I think in the two years almost two years we've owned it. I think there have been two days when it hasn't run. Really? Just really. just that? Yeah. The control that you've got on this machine, we, we did speak about your first entry into CNC. How do you find the programming of this? Well, this is a very different kettle of fish to the Prototrack. This is still relatively easy. It is Siemens. And it's relatively easy, but it takes a lot of getting your head round to start with. But that comes from the very fact that you've never used a machine of this technology. Never. No, never. And again, the XYZ applications, engineers and backup, they were without price, without worth. They and, were. and now when you get a, a drawing from a customer, do you look at it and think, wow, this would have taken me three machines or three or four operations, I can do it all in one now? Yeah, regularly. Bring it down here. And nine times out of ten, done in one up and done quickly. And, and with the very fact that you are tight for space, the fact that you can do a lot more on one machine has, has got to be a bonus. Oh, certainly. Um, every machine that we have in here has its place and its use and it can do things the others can't. So if I was to summarise, or you were to summarise, now someone's thinking of buying an XYZ, they're thinking, shall I, shan't I, what would you say? I'd say go for it. Talk to them, they're very professional, the machines are very good, we've got three. We've never had a breakdown. What I more think, can I say? I don't think you can. Brilliant. Thanks, Mick. You're welcome.